Hey guys, welcome to Protocoders Point. Okay, so in this photo tutorial, we're gonna learn how to pass a data from one screen to another screen. I have already made a tutorial on this in the, in the easiest way to understand how to pass a data. You can watch this video tutorial if you have not watched. Okay, so in this tutorial, what we are going to do is, here we, I have created a sample app as an intro of this tutorial. So here I have a list of data being shown in a list view. So whenever a user select any item from this, for example, Apple. So it has a image and a name. So when I press on this, the same data will be sent to a second screen where our image will be displayed with the uh, text. Okay, so for example, if I select mango, so you can see the mango image will be sent from first screen to second screen with mango as a title and mango as a description. Okay, so let's begin with the tutorial. Okay, so let's go to our Android Studio to build it. So here I have already created a new photo project by name passing data and removed all the default code. And now it simply has a scaffold widget with the app bar and a container. Okay, so first of all, we need a data model to hold all this data. So let's create it in your lib directory. Create a new dart file and name it as fruit data model. Create a class fruit data model. And here you need three data that is name of your fruit uh, image and the description of your image okay so let's create it name image URL and the description okay and now let's create a constructor for this just right click generate constructor and mark all these three data and okay Okay, so our data model is ready with a constructor. Okay, so now let's go to main.dat. So here we need to create a list of data to be passed to our data model. So let's create. So here static list of type string fruit name. And let's create an array of fruit name. For example, apple, banana. So like this okay and we also need a url of this images for example apple image banana image mango image okay so i have already done that i will just copy paste that list of array so here i have url and this is for apple this is for banana mango orange and pineapple okay so we have five data Okay, so let's generate a list final list fruit data model okay fruit data is equal to list dot generate okay so here we are going to generate a list of data and store it in this object okay so what we are going to do is we are going to take this uh, data dot length okay so this list will be get generated five data that is apple banana and this and we are going to pass this data to our uh, data model fruit fruit data model so as you can see we need to pass the data as we have created constructor over here so first thing is name of our fruit so to pass the data fruit name of index image url of index and for description what we will do is we will just make use of fruit name with the description fruit name of index and here we will pass just add a text okay so what we have done is we have just created a list of fruit name with the image and we have gen by making use of this list we have generated a list of data by making use of fruit data model okay so this is the object that we can use in our code okay so now let's create a list view and show our data in our list view okay so here i will just remove the container and instead of that i will just make use of list view dot builder list view dot builder okay so here we need to pass the number of data that we need to create in a list view so item count 
fruit data fruit data dot length okay so this is fruit data dot length so this size of this fruit data we need to generate okay so item builder so in item builder context and index okay so here we need to pass a return card child list tell okay so in the list tell we need to show our title text widget fruit data of index dot name name of name of our fruit as you can see this okay and in the leading uh, leading tag we need to show our image so leading sized box sized box and width of 50 dp and height of 50 dp okay and children image dot network and here we need to show our network data so that is fruit data dot sorry index dot url image url okay so now if i run this code okay so app got restarted so as you can see our app is app has generated a list of data so now when i press on this data nothing is happening because we have not coded it yet so this is working now okay so whenever the user press on this item i need to navigate the user to next screen so let's code it so here in uh, list tool you can see there is a property called as on tab okay so we can make use of it so here on tab print tab so we'll just restart okay so when i press on this mango so you can see it is getting tapped okay so now let's create one more page to show the tabbed data on that page so just create new dart file fruit detail okay import material dot dart stateful widget stateless widget i can use fruit detail default for now i will just keep it empty body tag so in body tag i must show two datas as you can see okay so it is refreshed sorry uh, so here i need to show two datas that is image and the description of our uh, product that is fruit so in column widget cross axis alignment is not needed uh, children tag so first of all i need to show a image image dot network and then i need to show a text widget with a description of our image okay so now let's from our main dot dart file we will just navigate the user to fruit details so for that we will make use of navigate navigator dot push dot off context dot push material material page root builder context and just load this page detail okay so i will just refresh okay so now when i press on this any item of this list so you can see our detail page gets open okay so this is error because i have not am not making use of any data in our network image so just ignore that error okay so now here i need to pass our data to our list uh, fruit data details page okay so for that in your fruit details create a final uh, fruit data model object fruit data model and here this dot 
root data model okay so this is showing an error because this is not nullable so what we will do is i will just make it as required now here we need from here we need to pass the data to this page okay so for that fruit data model and here we will pass our this object and that index that is been tapped by the user so for that here fruit data of index we need to pass okay so now from here we are going to pass the data to this uh, fruit details and we are just constructing the data and by making use of this that uh, object we can show our data in our screen okay so here i will just remove this fruit data model dot image url and fruit data model dot description and in the app bar fruit data model dot name okay so now let's restart our app okay so we have a list of data so when i press on the apple so you can see the apple as app bar the image and the app description orange orange banana and the banana image is there with the banana description and a banana title okay so that's all for this video tutorial hope you got the concept of how to pass a data from one screen to another screen please do subscribe protocol as point thank you